The summer is here. Okay, it's not even June yet, but we do need some new summer anthems. So we made a list of five artists to look out for this summer. You're watching the drop. What's good, people? I'm Jay Snow. What's good, people? I'm Cindy Lucia. You don't have to mock me. Coming in at number five is Frank Ocean. It's been a while since we heard anything from him, but he just recently announced that he will be doing a sequel to his Channel Orange album, which is pretty dope. That's exciting. I know, right? That's so exciting. I'm excited. You seem excited. I, yes, I'm very excited. Clapping all in my face on my lines and stuff. Like, chill. Damn, it ain't out I yet. Wasn't, like, I wasn't damn. clapping in your face. This is clapping in your face. Okay, you know, I'm excited because I love the first Channel Orange album. And I feel like since Miguel is on tour and recording his next album, Chris Brown is in jail, there's been a lapse of like good male R&B songs. That is crazy because Miguel was just all over the place. Now he's nowhere to be found. I mean, he's probably waiting for us to forget about this. Sam Smith. Why did I put my hands up like Sam Smith? <laughs> He's oh my god. Oh my god. Stay with me. Cause you're Yeah, he's kind of like the male version of Adele to me, you know? He's like British chubby and he can sing his ass off. He first popped up on a song called Latch, which actually came out in 2012. It's so crazy because I just recently found out about it and I think most people did, but I love it. Every morning in the car, I sing it. And now I've got you in my place. They not gonna listen to it now. Coming in at our number three spot is Ellie Mack. She's from Honolulu, Hawaii, and she actually does reggae, which is perfect for the summer. I don't know what to do when the dub stops. Yeah, she got some little cute friends too. I'm probably never gonna meet them. Never, so, so like, okay. Hey. I wonder if Ellie Mac gets big, if she's gonna drop the whole reggae thing like Rihanna did. Yeah, because we know that's what Rihanna did. Pawn to replay my ass. One by one, even two by two, everybody in the club gonna be rocking with them too. She dropped that front quick. Right, she used to let her forehead show freely in the beginning and everything. She just didn't care. Number two is Kanye West, and this is solely just me being selfish because we need that for the summer. I need another cruel summer. Yeah, I'm excited to see what he's gonna do after Jesus because, you know, it got such bad reviews and it was just kinda like, eh, I'm not f***ing with it, I, but. I with Jesus. Of course you do. But I feel like now he's gonna come out with something really dope. Like, cool, you got that out your system, all that emo, crazy, weird. I just hope he don't come out with no, no full love album for him and Kim and then the baby and like, come on, man, go no, back to No, I don't want to hear that. Yeah, nobody wants to hear that. that. All right, so our number one is gonna go to Nicki Minaj. Her next album, The Pink Print, it doesn't have a release date yet, but I'm expecting it to come out like late Jaloon. Jaloon? <laughs> Whenever the f that is, <laughs> Jaloon. <laughs> no, I think late Jaloon. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like the coolest month, so surprisingly. Ever! Like, like what's I your birthday? I can't wait till Jaloon gets here. <laughs> like, you were born in Jaloon? <laughs> Are you special? Thumbs up if Jaloon should be a month. No, I think it's gonna come out late June or early July, is what I was trying to say. Okay. And I'm gonna be excited for that. I love rapping to Nicki Minaj lyrics, because it's like... <laughs> like, I hate that shit. That concludes our list of five artists to look out for this summer. And now it's time for Ask the Drop. Brian White said, what are your guys' thoughts on the XXL freshman class of 2014? It was good, you know, my problem with that is their freshman people are people who have been like buzzing in the streets for a couple of years, and then they'll be like, look who's out now, like Chance the Rapper's on it, like really? Yeah. I mean, I still haven't seen it yet, to tell you the truth. I should have probably, I, I didn't, I haven't seen you know, it. I'm so sorry, I let you down. I let you down. We want to figure out your musical taste, so we've got a question for you. Don't worry, there's no wrong answer. Which one of these three female artists do you want new music from this summer? A, Iggy Azalea, B, Nicki Minaj, or C, Rita Ora? Let us know in the comments below. Honestly, Rita Ora is just bad to me, like, no. Okay, <laughs> make sure you guys subscribe to All Def Digital. I'm Cynthia Lucia. And I'm Jay Snow. See you tomorrow on the drop, right? Tomorrow? Yep, because today's okay, only Thursday. We got another episode this week. Damn it, I got it yes. right. Yes. <laughs>